you guys it is your girl Bree, and i am back with another freaking vloggy vlog okay your girl is trying to do a little bit better okay so we're about to go run some errands and i was like i might as well vlog and bring y'all with me and then i'm cooking tonight it's out of two things we haven't made up our mind yet so but i know i'm cooking so we're gonna pick up something while we're out running the errands i got on this little half top thing that i got from target i actually got in like three different colors but I really like this and I prefer it on this arm y'all so I actually turned it it's supposed to be on this side but I thought it looked better if my tattoo was out which I think I like it better this way but anyway so I got this little shirt on like a little half shirt it's just a little plain white shirt then I got on some of my black biker shorts with my what are these my croc slides the little slides and then I got my little black furry purse that I had got before forever 21 sparkle sitting here looking crazy tisha is getting ready so we can go and i know y'all see this stuff behind me but we did go to sam's i meant to record that to include in this vlog but i never did we had got two cases of water the 40 pack we got two things of coke which i think each one has 24 yep. we got the big thing of tissue big thing of the paper towels yep. we got these the unstoppable and what else did we get for the toilet right oh yeah and then lysol. we got like the yeah then we got like the lysol the ones for the toilet to clean the toilet the little kind that you put in there and then clean it we got like a box of that i think four came in there so we got that and i think that's all we had got yeah drinks toiletries yeah that's all we had got we didn't get anything else so y'all didn't miss much on that but we're completely out of grocery, so that's why we gotta pick something up while we're out. And then tomorrow we're gonna actually probably go grocery shopping for real. We just need to get something for tonight. But I have quite a few places that I wanna go. I wanted to go to Trader Joe's, but I don't feel like it no more. Cause it's only like one or two, don't laugh. It's only like one or two things that I wanted to get from Trader Joe's. And I just feel like it ain't worth it to get that because Trader Joe's over here is always packed. And it's like, is it really worth? Are those two things? Do I want them bad enough to where I want to find a parking spot, walk up there, walk inside, find them, go on the line, get back in? Do I want to do all that? No, I don't. So we're gonna go to Target for sure. We're going to, yes, yeah, so we're gonna go to Target what for sure. Target for? So we're going to Target for sure. I know I have to get Sparkle, so I'm seasoning for her food. Um, I started getting her this seasoning and she's completely out and so I need to get her some more because I don't I haven't seen it anywhere else so that and then I need to get these things that I wanted to get that go up under your eyes y'all know what I'm talking about the things for the bags and stuff I don't have bags but I want to try them because um I saw one I saw one brand that has like vitamin C and I was watching what's her name I was watching my fam I don't know if any of y'all watch her but it's this Asian chick love her to death she was talking about these kind of had like vitamin C and it just helps you look more alive you know okay. especially when you have long nights so I was like anyway so I have to get me some of those honey I checked online they have them and then she was talking about these b12 patches that you just like stick on yourself somewhere randomly and it's supposed to wake you up so I was like I need to try both of those you know what I'm saying real influencers will have you broke okay and the people I watch they be about to have me broke especially my fam and especially Chelsea the one who lives in Atlanta I don't know if y'all watch them but they be about to have me broke but go there for that Tom Thumb to get to make a couple of groceries, not a lot. And then, was there somewhere else I needed to go? I don't think there was nowhere else I needed to go. I think, I think I wanted to go to Trader Joe's, but I'm not gonna go. So we're gonna go to Target, we're gonna go to Tom's Club. I don't know where else. And y'all, I'm gonna say this. I feel like the whole thing about crumble cookies is completely capped. People are, I don't wanna call people liars, but people are liars, okay? They be capping. Those cookies don't be that good. I've tried them once or twice. Okay, the first time I tried them was on Tisha's birthday last year. Her cousin got her some the chocolate chip one. I really wasn't feeling. Then, then my boss had some like what the other week, and I tried the fudge, like chocolate kind of chip she had. I don't know what kind of it was. It was like a fudge cookie, like an all chocolate. It was all chocolate. Bomb. I liked it actually. So I was like, you know, we're gonna go today. We're gonna give them one last chance. And we're gonna try a selection of them, you know. Everybody be getting a little box, and we're gonna see. We're gonna see once and for all. But I just, I'm just not with like high 
types. When everybody's getting one thing, I'm not just going to be like, oh, these are the best things just because everybody's getting them, okay? So we're going to probably stop and get some of those. I want to get some just to give them one last, like, standing chance and try all of them. Well, all of them that they have available today. But, so that's one stop. And then I think that's it. And then I have some stuff to do when I get here. And then, of course, I'll let y'all see me cook. But it's just a regular evening, y'all. We just got off work. And it is what it is. Just chilling, okay? But Tisha has to run an errand first. And she's sitting here waiting for me to hurry up. So, y'all, let's go ahead and get up in the streets, okay? <laughs> Okay. Okay. So y'all, we had to get her this broth because they're out of the seasoning. It's just like, it's like, why y'all add a dog seasoning? How many people buy dog seasoning? I guess we're not the only ones. like a cabbage soup if you're older then you already have seen me make this and it's basically where i do cabbage and cut up red potatoes and all the um colors of the bell pepper honey and onions chicken and sausage sometimes i do shrimp but i'm not doing shrimp today so i'm gonna go through this stuff really really fast y'all Keisha has never tried the glorious margarita so i decided to get some of that so we're gonna probably fix us a glass of that i kind of want to go sit on the rooftop but you know hey I'm gonna have to see how I feel because I gotta cook. And then, so the stuff I'm gonna show you first is from Target. So, the margarita mix. And then we got some bone broth for Sparkle because they did not have her seasoning. Okay. And then I also got these Pixie Beauty Eye Vitamin C and Brightening Eye Patches, the things that go up under your eyes. I told y'all I was gonna try these. And so, this is what it looks like in case you wanna check it out. And then we both got a match that we're gonna do later on. I got like a citrus kind, and then Tisha got a pineapple kind. So that's what these look like. And then I also found the B12 Awake patches that I was looking for. It's four of these for like 10 bucks, so I hope they work, honey. I can't wait to see. Every time I go to the Super Target, I always have to get me some of these cookies because they, can, sorry y'all, because they be so soft. So I always get these when we go to Target because they're just super soft. But it's always three for 99 cents. So I got me one of those. And then I also wanted to get some of these noodles because we're gonna have ramen one day this week. I wanted to specifically use these noodles. So I knew Target had them because I had put out, where I see it at? I think I saw it on Pinterest that they always have them. So they were in there, so I grabbed those. Also, I wanted to get a couple of like little Lunchables for a snack, don't judge me. I got the turkey and cheddar, two of these. 
And then Tisha got turkey and provolone cheese. That's it for Target. So then moving on to Tom Thumb. I got me a pack of Twinkies. Again, don't judge me. I be craving those a lot. Tisha picked up these Tabasco Slim Jims that I got her on, honey. Six grams of protein. You know, every time I put her on with some y'all, she gotta, she gotta pick it up, honey. She gotta pick it up. So she grabbed these for us. And then I also got a six count of Dr. Pepper. Look, y'all, I wanna go ahead and take this time to say happy birthday to Queen Sugar, okay? AKA my girl. Um, if you're an oldie, you know who that is. You can see her in the comments, honey. And she loves Dr. Pepper. These are for her birthday. I ordered her a little mini fridge, okay? Shh, don't tell her, don't tell nobody. I got her a little mini fridge, just like it has Dr. Pepper. She, y'all, she's obsessed with Dr. Pepper. So I got her these to go in there because it only fits six. So I got this little six pack to go in there once it gets here tomorrow. And then she's off work all this week. So when she gets in next week, it'll be on her desk waiting for her. So happy birthday, Queen Sugar. Love you, girl. You know, you're a real one, okay? And I hope that you enjoyed your day, okay? But anyways, you guys, so next thing we got hot sauce, we got Louisiana, and we got Tabasco. We got some Red Bulls, Tisha got two, because she's obsessed with them now, and I'm trying to wing her off of them, but she's not trying to let up off of them. And then I got some diced jalapeno peppers, I got some mild Rotel, Tisha got her one of these Chef Boyardee beefaronis that I have her addicted to now too. She got that for lunch because we're going to go to the store tomorrow to get some more groceries. We just didn't feel like it today. So she got her that for tomorrow's lunch because she gets real hungry. And then I got these red potatoes. These are for the cabbage too. I got some jalapeno sausage, which is for the cabbage as well. And then the bell peppers, the yellow, orange, red, and green. That's also for the cabbage. And then I also got the chicken breast tenderloins. And this is also for the cabbage. I'm gonna cook that and cut that up to go in there as well. And then we got some cut up onions. I know y'all got a lot of stuff that's already pre-cut up, but Tisha has to cut all this stuff. And I just, it just be a lot. So I just tried to get some of it cut up already. And then here's our cabbage, which is gonna be the thing she really gotta cut up. So yeah, there's the cabbage. And then I was really craving some Capri Sun. So I got me some strawberry kiwi kind. And then Tisha got a Jimmy Dean sausage, an egg bowl, and then she got the bacon one as well. And then I got me just a little small thing of the Baby Bell because I wanted some of those. And then last but not least, my first love, my turtle pie. Y'all, I love this turtle pie and I have been craving it. It's all I've been talking about. I've been saying, when we go to the store, I'm gonna get me a turtle pie. And baby, I did, okay? Now, y'all, the only thing I went to the freaking store and freaking forgot. What was the tish? Your plug-ins. My freaking plug-ins, my refills, y'all. I'm so upset because the one, I had bought a bunch, like, to have in bulk, and I just really thought I had more than what I had, and I just am upset. The house still smells good, of course, and, you know, I got incense. So y'all know it's going to smell good in here regardless, but I just love my plug-ins. The one in the kitchen just went out. The one in the closet went out. And is that it? And the one in the bathroom. How so, in the closet door? I don't know. I had to put it on low. Now, all these yeah. other ones I didn't change since then. Anyway, Tisha trying to blame me. Long story short, we got to get some more. So, when we go to the store tomorrow, we're going to get some refills, okay? I love my refills. They, they are expensive, but I love my refills, okay? All right, y'all. So, and then we did still stop by Crumble and get the cookies. So I'm going to show y'all these. We're going to do a little taste test later, but I want to go ahead and let y'all see them, okay? There they go. That one then broke off, child. Ooh, Lord, presentation point lost on this way. Probably for me shaking it, but we got the little Rice crispy one. We got the, I think that's like a Twix or something with caramel right here. And then this is like a peanut butter cup type cookie and then I wanted that m and cookie so we're gonna try these and we're gonna see what's popping we're gonna see if they good let me smell them <laughs> you know could smell better but we're gonna try them in a little bit y'all so that. Be close. 
don't know how and what to do I'm so shy when it comes to you but I guess you're curious huh so let me show you what I can do cause I, I don't Latest heck, we weren't even really out that long, so I don't know why it's so late already. Like, it's like the time just sped right on by us. So, I'm about to tell y'all what I think of these crumble cookies that we chose today. The food is boiling, it's actually probably ready to eat. So, after I do this, we'll probably go ahead and eat. But I want to go ahead and try each one of these. Tisha can't eat stuff like this without ruining her appetite, but see. Baby, I can eat dessert first, last, in the middle of the dinner. It don't make me no difference. So, the first thing that your girl gotta do is smell it before I eat it. <laughs> so, this is the first one. I don't know why it's so thick like this, but we're gonna try the Rice crispy one, child. Sweet like the ones that we get from the stove. What? what? They taste like, huh? Diabetes or I don't know. These cookies gotta be for diabetes. Because even Tiff's treats, theirs aren't as sweet, but they're still good. So I don't know. It's okay. One to ten, I'll give it a five. Because it ain't sweet enough. Yeah. It's, not, it's not sweet enough. I don't know what's going on. Okay. It just, it just wasn't sweet enough, y'all. It wasn't hitting. It reminded me of, like, the homemade ones. Oh. So, like, how they're kind of, like, yeah. sweet, but not too sweet. Yeah. Like that. So, this is the next one. This is the one they got with the Twix crumbles and caramel on it and chocolate. So, let's try this one. I mean, they cookies don't even smell like that. So, I don't get it. 
you know how you smell something and it just smells good? You know, like some fresh baked muffins or something? So then they'll be up in there baking this shit fresh. I don't know, right? They show up back there. Yeah, they was back there just, you know it's open in there so you can see them just making it. Okay. This one up eight. Okay. It's pretty good. First of all, I like sugar cookies, so I feel like this batter is kind of like sugar based, like a sugar cookie. And then, of course, I love adore caramel, and I love Twix, so I feel like the caramel and stuff and the crumbles just it's, it's giving it. It's giving. It's giving what it's supposed to give. Scared to try this one. Okay, y'all. This is the peanut butter one, like the peanut butter cup, whatever they called it. Looks pretty. Let me smell it. It's my like peanut butter. Yeah. Oh, it's gonna be too much peanut butter. But I actually like peanut butter cookies, but I have to be in the mood for them. I've been craving them sometimes. Remember I craved them not too long ago? Um, I give it a seven. Great American is a ten. As you can see, the highest I could give was an eight. The cookies just aren't worth the hype that everybody be saying. Like I said, my boss had a chocolate one recently that she gave me because she had two of them, and it was bomb. Okay, now that one I probably would have gave a nine and a half, ten. Okay, the chocolate one was really, really good. But I just, just be going there and getting cookies. I don't think I could ever just go there and get cookies. I'd rather go to the, take my time to go to the store and then turn the oven. I don't let it preheat yeah. and put them in the oven. I'd rather go and just buy those. Because they're just not all that in a bag of chips. Like, everybody be claiming. But, y'all, this vlog, it may be a little short, y'all, but this was just a typical day in the life okay i'll update y'all on the products that i bought today in the next vlog let y'all know how i'm liking them if you've tried any of the products that i got today and you adore them or something went wrong let your girl know down in the comments okay and let me know y'all feeling crumble are y'all like really about the crumble life like people be yeah. you know around her being like because when right before it became a craze we tried them because her cousin had got them for her away last year for her birthday. And I wasn't really hearing people talk about them like that. And then now all of a sudden they're a whole thing. Yeah. I even see De'Ara talking about she got to have them all the time. Girl, they're not that good. <laughs> they just not that good. But anyways, you guys, love you guys. Two freaking pieces. Okay, your girl is exhausted. I am tired, y'all. I'm ready just to eat and go to bed. I will insert a little clip of my food right here right here <laughs> but you guys love y'all like i said like comment and subscribe and i will see y'all in the next freaking video peace out